Hello everyone and welcome back to another of my videos. In today's video, I will review a watch and a pair of accessories from local fashion label Black by Blue Brave. Now, more specifically the brand sent me here, it's a HS7 watch, the black classic sunglasses, as well as a Love Wins uh, bracelet. So let's see if they're any good. Now let's start first with the HS7 watch. So let's get this out of the way. First and foremost, you know, the HS7 watch uses a flat sapphire crystal. As aforementioned in my previous reviews, I'm a huge advocate of sapphire crystal due to the inherent scrap resisting properties. I always look for sapphire crystal in my modern watches as it really adds significantly in the watch's the durability. It also has a water resistant rating of about 100 meters, which makes it perfect for an everyday watch. Although, you know, with this leather strap, you probably wouldn't want to, you know, go into a pool with it. Now, on the back, let me bring this a bit closer to the camera. It's actually powered by the automatic Miyota 8N24 movement, which is unsurprising as it's one of the few affordable scatternized movement in the market today. It beats at 3Hz or 21,600 beats per hour, it hand winds, and you know, has about 42 hours of power reserve but does not hack. So you can see here that interestingly, you know, they've done away with the traditional rotor, but instead opted for this full-size one that you know, resembles a sports car, the wheel of a sports car. It's quite striking and see, you know, the slightest movement uh, gets it rotated. You can also glimpse that the movement is actually a bit decorated underneath as well. So yeah, you know, I think this is this sort of full-size wheel instead of a rotor. I think it's a quite a striking you know, decision and one that's rarely seen at this price point. Now, another striking thing would be this glossy sort of full alligator strap uh, that comes with the watch. You can see that it has red contrasting stitching and you know, a matching black buckle over here. So this is not a genuine alligator, of course. Uh, a genuine alligator strap will cost half the watch itself. This, but this full alligator strap you know, still feels very premium. Uh, you can see that it has very clear stamping. And it comes with a fairly comfortable lining over here. It says script release pins, so you will note that due to the... I, let me see if I can show it to you. Due to the nature of the strap, uh, it's quite hard, I think, for you to find sort of off-the-shelf you know, strap that is sort of this cut out. So, yeah. Now, according to the brand Black by Blue Brave, the HS7 is heavily inspired by the aesthetic of modern-day sports cars, with this dial in particular meant to evoke the speedometers of sports cars. So this sort of, I mean, brings a bit closer, this semi scatternized nature of the dial sort of enhances the sportiness of the HS7, and I also like how the hands are scatternized, which keeps it thematically relevant. There's this rim-like fixture, this red and white, rim like fixture at the center of the dial, I think that's cool as well, reinforcing the automotive inspiration. And overall I think this black and you know red aesthetic is well done. Um it's quite cool obviously the black, but you know the red accent uh used in good proportion to provide sharp contrast without looking too garish or obnoxious. However there are still a few aspects of the watch I don't like, the chief of which being this non-functional a chronograph pusher. So you can see here that the watch actually has chronograph pushers over here and yeah, you can't press them, you know, they're non-functional. So when I first received the watch, I was quite confused as to why there were these you know, chronograph pushers that didn't work. So I guess, you know, the brand thought it would make the watch look a bit more sporty, but to me, I'm not a fan of, let's call it spade a spade, useless features on the watch. The same goes to the bezel, it's actually fixed, so you know, you cannot rotate it. I prefer a rotational bezel, or at the very least, perhaps like a tachymeter, like the one that you see on a Speedmaster. I think these would have been more thematically relevant to the automotive nature of the watch. Now, another inspiration I picked up on was this Hublot uh, Big Bang you know, kind of lux. So you can see here that there's this sort of uh, Hublot lux, which I think adds again to the, that you know, uh, sort of steeps down very, curves down very steeply, I mean. And yeah. It gives the watch, I guess, a sportier vibe. So, you know, this, I will say that even this scatternized, uh, semi scatternized dial, and even the numerals can be said to be inspired by Hubo Big Bang. You can certainly see the inspirations. Although the HS7 is original enough in its execution, I would say, to not be labeled as a mere homage. And overall, I would say that the entire package is masculine and sporty, and should suit those that prefer more striking watches. Now, let me put this on the wrist and show you guys how it wears. Okay, so I'll do a slow wrist roll. You can see the strap being very close and very free and very premium. So there you go, that's the HS7. So yeah, with a case diameter of 43.5mm, uh, on paper it looks large, but it's not overly so because of you know, 
uh, the lungs have really steeped quite downwards. Yeah, integrated lungs of salt, I guess you could say. So you can see that's an overhang on my 7 inch wrist at all. It's not the slimmest at 12.5mm thick, but it will still you know, fit under a shirt cuff, although just about. So all in all, you know, I would say that this uh, HS7 by Black by Blue Brave is good value. At $390 after the promo code below, you get a watch that has decent specs and a striking presence on the wrist. Uh, it's not perfect by any means, I would say, but if you just want like a sporty fashion for a watch that doesn't cost a bomb, then this HS7 would be a good option. Alright, so now let's move on to the sunglasses. You know, so the brand also sent me a pair of its trademark sunglasses. Um, and like the HS7, I would say the Black by Blue Braves Black Classic Sunglasses. So these are called the Black Classic Sunglasses. It's so big and bold. In terms of fit, you know, it's on the slightly larger side. You can see how, sort of how big it is. Making great for those who prefer sunglasses with more presence. The lens itself, as you can see, you can see my hand uh, beneath. The lens itself are slightly translucent too allowing the eyes to be slightly visible while still providing protection. Alright, so you can see that the legs of sunglasses are also translucent. You can see my hand underneath. Uh, and you can see a brand logo here is very nicely embossed with the frame itself here you go, being thick enough to provide structure. So overall, I would say I actually quite like these, you know, black classic sunglasses. Um, it's subtly elegant. I can definitely see myself wearing it at the beach or perhaps on a sunny day outdoors. It's a classic silhouette, but it's bold and striking enough uh, to command attention without being over the top. At $92 after the promo code, it's well positioned as a mid-range offering. So more expensive than those from like Miniso, but also significantly cheaper than let's say something like a branded one like Ray-Bans. Okay, so last and certainly not least, Black by Blue Brave also sent me its Love Wins bracelet in honor of Pride Month. Now, I've reviewed bracelets before, but the Love Wins bracelet has to be my favorite. You know, like the watch and the sunglasses, the Love Wins bracelet is meant to be a conversation starter with an array of rainbow gems set upon a rose-plated silver bracelet. I really do uh, love that fact. Yes, you know, the bracelet is crafted from 925 sterling silver, making this technically precious metal. The stones itself are cubic zirconia, which are man-made gemstones that are meant to resemble diamonds, albeit at a fraction of the price. So actually, by nature, uh, cubic zirconia is naturally colorless, which allows manufacturers, I guess like them, to color them with coloring agents, as is the case you can see. It's really very nice. Now, I really do like this Love Wind bracelet. Let me actually put this on the wrist. So you know, one of my absolute grail watches is actually the Rainbow Daytona. No, obviously that's out of my league. So wearing this Love Wind uh, bracelet makes me feel like I'm wearing like, the bezel of the Rainbow Daytona on my wrist, and it really scratches the itch until I'm hopefully one day able to afford one. It's brilliantly executed, no pun intended. And the rainbow of Cupid's Zirconia really catches the eye beautifully. At $127 after the promo code below, it's actually fairly affordable for a 925 bracelet that's uh, adorned with Cupid's Zirconia stones. Alright, so in conclusion, when viewed from a fashion's lens, the offerings from Black by Blue Wave certainly live up to their building. The HS7 watch is a striking automotive-inspired watch that's backed by decent specs, the black classic sunglasses here, you know, is a stylish wardrobe staple, while this Love Wind bracelet is a fun and quirky accessory that will spark conversations. So if you're more adventurous in your fashion accessories, then Black by Blue Braves product should do the trick without coming across as ostentatious. And despite, you know, its numerous physical locations, so the brand I believe has a flagship outlet over in 303 Somerset, prices remain somewhat affordable, allowing you to look great without burning a hole in your wallet. So those interested in purchasing any of these products, you know, the sunglasses, the watch, this bracelet, can use the promo code WASOSHOK for 20% off all items from its web store. After the discount, the HS7 watch, this can be had for $391, the black classic sunglasses at $92, and this Love Wind bracelet at $127. And as an accessories label, you know, the brand Black by Blue Brave seems to be going from strength to strength. Start the watch, start the watches, move on the eyewear, move on the bracelets. So I can't wait to see uh, what other accessories you know the homegrown brand offers next. Alright, so that rounds up uh, my review of these products by Black by Blue Brave. It's very refreshing to cover back a local brand again, I must say. So if you like this video, do give it a thumbs up, do comment down below what you think of the products, and as always, share the video around. Subscribe if you haven't yet. I will see you guys in my next video as always. So, ciao!